Hey guys, what's up? Okay, JB, and today we are opening the Scarlet and Violet 151 Ultra Premium Collection. Now, normally I skip out on these big sort of uh, ticket items. I normally just say, you know, I get whatever promos I kind of want out of them if I want any, and I kind of skip out on the rest, but this is too good to get. And I actually found these at GameStop, so I picked up one, and um, I got it for slightly under retail since I am a member. I think it was 114, I think, before tax, so not too bad. So, of course, guys, my camera is like pretty far out. This thing is absolutely huge. So I'm gonna zoom this in for the opening, of course, but let's check out the back real fast, just so we can see exactly what comes in this. <clears throat> Good shot of my Charizard mat there too. So in this, guys, we get a whole bunch of cool stuff. Of course, you get these three promos, which we'll take a closer look at. You get the Mew EX, the Mew 2, and the Mew EX gold card. Now these two arts here are two of my favorite arts. I'm super stoked to have these in the collection. So of course you get those. Oh, oh, that's actually a metal card. Okay, so I didn't know that. So that's a metal card. Very cool. You also get a play mat, of course, a deck box, a metallic uh, coin featuring Mew, the damage counters, plastic ninja markers, whatever. And then, of course, 16 packs of 151. Now, some of you guys might have seen people's hits out of these have been pretty whack. Now, my ETB hits were fantastic. So we're going to hope we keep the luck rolling with this. And you also get a code card online. So let's crack this open and um, get the camera resituated. Okay, guys, so you take the sleeve off of the box, and this is the box you are presented with. Absolutely gorgeous. This is awesome. And then you open this up, and you just get all of this wonderful stuff inside, and the promos are sitting there up top. All right, so I'll show you guys the promos, how they're situated, but let me pull all this stuff out of here first, I guess, before I get to that. So let's get out all of these booster packs here. Just set these on the side like that. Guys, this whole box with the Pokemon just monochrome. Uh, design is just so beautiful and of course of course i smacked the camera of course we got uh, some more of these sleeves in here which i love or is that the deck box i think okay i said that's the deck box okay i love that design though so much super cool there's that mew coin there super sparkly love that some more damage counters and dice of course this is the play mat which i will also get situated and this part actually comes out of there okay so this is what they were situated in so these are the promos of course guys we get the mew ex promo the gold Mew EX card there in the middle, which is definitely heavier. You can kind of sort of see it sliding around there. And there is the Mew card as well. Super cool. Let's take a close look at those. Let's take a look at this playmat here featuring one of my favorite Pokemon, Mew, and the beautiful Pokemon uh, monogram sort of pattern there. Absolutely love that, guys. That is super cool. Honestly, probably my favorite playmat in my collection now. I brought that camera in a little bit. Let's take a look at those promos. Now, they were in a really cool frame, that sort of uh, cardboard frame. Would have been nice to keep them there, but some of the cards look stressed. Mostly the Mew EX promo I'm about to show, but this card, guys, oh my god, I love this artwork of Mewtwo over the city. When I saw this card in Japanese, I was like, wow, in English, this is a card I'm going to have to pull or buy. But it comes in the UPC, and I happened to find one, so yeah, super stoked about that. We just have Mewtwo there glaring over the city. Gorgeous art. This is the Mew EX promo now. Oh my god, the foiling looks crazy, but as you can see, it has the code card back there too, so I assume the two cards sort of stuffed in that um, that cardboard there. Definitely put some stress on the card a little bit, but just, it's, I mean, it looks, it looks gorgeous though. Super stoked on this. And there is that absolutely crazy metal Mew EX gold card. This is super cool. I actually have never owned one of these gold uh, promo cards or metal promo cards, so super stoked to have this, guys. And even the back... Wow, just looks so cool. This is something I definitely want to put in like some kind of clear frame or maybe I'll get this graded or something. We'll see. All right, we got 16 packs, you guys. One to be one. Let's crack into this. This is, of course, the meat. We can see if we get some good value in here or not. All right, I'll give away these code cards here, of course, for you all to enjoy online. I think it's just one to the front. Yeah, okay, because let me get the energy. And it could be a, uh, a rare energy or it could just be um, a regular energy. We get those, those Cosmo Hollows in here too as well, though. Let's see what we get here. We got a Neo King. Oh, oh my God, my love, my 151 look, guys, is unreal. It's unreal. The first pack we pull the special illustration rare of Alakazam EX again. One of the hottest cards in the set. I've pulled the Blastoise, the Erica's Invitation, and now the Alakazam EX and a Hollow Electro there as well. But oh my God, I just I, I can't believe my my luck. I can't believe it. All right, we are starting off strong. Something I was going to mention earlier was that I may take some cards and uh, start uh, sending some submissions to PSA. I think those would be some pretty fun videos, of course, to record. And uh, I like collecting graded cards, but I typically never have them graded myself. I've never actually done that. So I think that would actually be a really fun thing to do. 
Let's see, we got a War Turtle, a Nidorino Reverse. We get another Art Rare, guys, in the second pack, a Tangela Art Rare. So cool. Oh my god. All the, the art in this set is fantastic. So super stoked to pull that as well. Oh my god. And again, here we get a full art Jinx EX for a double hit. Oh, we are back to back solid hits. This is already a good UPC. Oh my god. Pack number three. I just, oh my god. We are only three packs into this already. This is crazy. We are already hitting big, hitting big. Let's see though. I am stoked to hopefully pull some more of those Cosmo Hollow energies because I really do like those. I think I pulled four of them out of my ETB, so not too bad. A reverse EV, a reverse Dodo, and we got a Beedrill Hollow in that pack. I mean, you get 16 packs in these, so I actually could not believe that. I saw so many people online who were complaining and saying that you know, they opened an entire UPC and got maybe um, like a single hit, like a regular EX, no special illustration rare, no art rares. You know, they're kind of showing off their Cosmo Hollow energies as their main hits. We got a reverse Doug Trio, a reverse Machoke, and nice, we got a Golem EX in that pack. Sweet. I don't know why I can't remember Golem there as Golem, but yeah, there's that. That's the second EX of that card I pulled from this set. There's a code card there from this pack. Got one to the front. Oh, there we go. Sweet. A Psychic Hollow Energy. I don't think I've actually pulled one of those yet, so stoked to have that. Nice. We got a Jigglypuff, Staryu, Charmander, Spiro, Victory Bell, Big Air Balloon, Primeape, Reverse Porygon, Reverse Polyrath, and a Hollow Mr. Mime. I actually love the R on this card. All right, let's keep it rolling, see what we can get. Super stoked to see if I can get some more regular R rares at least. I'm a huge fan of those. I know a lot of them aren't even worth that much, but you know, all these illustration rares that are, are cheap right now, I, I have a feeling, ooh, there we go, another Hollow Energy. It's a Grass Energy, another new energy from my collection, I believe. Very nice. You know, I believe these R rare cards though, in the future are gonna be obviously cards that people are gonna kinda want, so. I think while they're cheap, good idea to get your hands on them. Golduck, Aerodactyl, and a Hollow Weezing in that pack. Oh man, are the rest of the pack's gonna be dry? We'll see. I doubt it. We had luck in the first two packs there. There's gotta be some more stuff there uh, hiding in this box here for me. We'll see. Let's go one to the front. We just got a regular energy in that pack. Meowth, Execute, Clefairy, Machop, Seedra, Kabuto, Gloom, Coughing, Omanite, and a Hollow Starmie. The hollows feel a bit strange. I'm not sure what it is. Something about the printing or something. It feels kind of off about them, the card stock. Let me know if you uh, you guys feel something kind of similar of your uh, 151. Didn't feel quite the same in the, um, the ETB. It, just, it feels a little different though in the uh, UPC cards here. All right, Kuno and a hollow Needle King. Eight packs left. That means we are halfway through. And so far, the hits were definitely uh, right there at the front. I'd be very surprised to pull something else, but you never know. I'm still looking for that Charizard, I still believe. I'm gonna hit that God Box, we'll see. There are God Packs, right? We're like sort of pseudo God Packs. Even and I and a Moltres. I think the God Packs, sort of like the last three cards will be like the Kanto Evolution line of uh, Special Illustration Rares, which, you know, obviously would just be super hot to pull. Let's see, we got, oh, nice, a Fire Cosmo Hollow Energy there. Absolutely love to pull those. At least those don't seem to be super rare, which I like. Uh, you know, that way at least, at least you pull those, which are very fun. A reverse Machop, Reverse Rattata, and a Hollow Raichu. All right, come on. Don't let me down. Where is the juice? I still believe. I still believe. Let's see what we got here. We got a code card there for y'all. One to the front. We got our regular Dark Energy. Mankey, Meowth, Execute, Clefairy, Scyther, Charmeleon, Parasect, a Dodrio Reverse, a Psyduck Reverse, and an Omastar. Regardless, of course, these UPCs are awesome, and they are the only ways to get those promos, so if you want to rip some 151, want to test your luck out, uh, be my guest, check it out. And if anyone has any you know data out there, maybe send me a link or I can, uh, let me know where, where I can find it. And see if anyone has, a, anyone has compiled the you know data for the average hits per UPC. I'll try and take a look after I open, uh, record this video. Execute and a Hollow Aerodactyl, again, with some awesome artwork. Four packs left. Things are starting to look grim, but... So believe and we got some good stuff already i'm actually not complaining but uh it's kind of crazy <laughs> you know some people have got less than this out of their hits there we go we got a fighting cosmo hollow energy as well it's the fourth hollow energy in this box actually pretty sweet i'd, I'd, I'd call that a pretty solid let's see we got a ride on uh a cycle road reverse oh nice a side dark reverse one of the one of the cards I actually wanted the most as well just love this art just shows a side like just walking down the stairs through a forest absolutely beautiful and we got a hollow ditto in that pack as well so much good art on these cards honestly all right happy to have at least pulled a few of the art rares still got three packs left though i believe in that last pack magic we are looking for 
the God Pack. We'll see if we can find it. We got a Lightning Energy in there, a Voltorb, Krabby, Sandshrew, Seal, Grabber, which I actually heard is a pretty valuable uh, uncommon card. A Reverse Sandshrew, Reverse Nidorita, and a Hollow Kakutops. All right, just two packs left. Let me know how your luck has been, guys, down in the comments below. Appreciate you all for watching this far. Those of you who have, whoever has, gets those code cards, of course. <laughs> there we go. We got the Grass Energy, a Tangela, Coughing, Psyduck, Ekans, a Rigid Band, Nidorino, Executor, a Reverse Pikachu, a Reverse Gengar, and a Hollow Electrode. And we have one final pack of 151 here to open. Regardless of the hits, I am super stoked with this box. <laughs> of course, the gas had to come at the absolute beginning of the video. That's all right. We got one to the front here. Let's see what we can get. We got regular Psychic Energy, Doduo, Tentacool, Radta, Squirtle, Rhydon, Exeggutor, Rigid Band, Reverse Horsey, Reverse Shelter, and we'll take that in our box EX to end things off. Not bad. All right, of course, we got those awesome promos there. Let's go over these hits, though, one more time. That was a solid UPC, I would say, compared to what a lot of people were apparently getting. So, of course, we got four of these basic uh, hollow energies. We got the Psychic Energy, Grass, Fire, and Fighting. We also got an Arbok EX. Don't think I pulled one of these in my uh, last box, so that's awesome. We got a Golem EX. Love to have that as well. The Full Art Jinx EX. Another new hit. Very cool to have one of the Full Art EXs. Then we got some Art Rares, of course. We got the Psyduck. Love that. We got Tangela. And then, of course, the absolute banger of a hit in this box. We got Alakazam EX, the special illustration rare. Absolutely gorgeous. Love the textures on this card, as always. Thank you all so much for watching. Of course, I hope we have some more Pokemon 151 content on the way. Subscribe for more trading card game content, though, of all sorts. And I'll see you all next time. Have a good one.